attacked upon Harper. They, but now, one of the things that happened to John Brown was John Brown was hanged, was he not? And so was Nat Turner. Both of were hanged. Tell me something about his, the, the hanging of John Brown. Now, I mentioned this in segment one. Stonewall, future Confederate General Stonewall Jackson and John Wilkes Booth, the, um, the man who assassinated Abraham Lincoln, uh, President Abraham Lincoln, were both present at his execution. And many people don't know this, but John Wilkes Booth stole a Confederate uniform to gain admission to John Brown's execution. Now, I'm not exactly sure why he wanted to be there so badly that he had to steal a Confederate outfit. But basically, when you think about it, you can think about he wanted to see, he, he wanted to see him die. He wanted to see somebody who cared about slavery die, perish. Mm -hmm. and, and so with these two insurrections, the John Brown slave insurrection and uh, the uh, Emmett Till, and, and I think one, one of the final in incidents of uh, violence in the South has, has to do with, some, with the uh, celebration of Dr. King's birthday. What about uh, the assassination of Dr. Martin Luther King? And how would you fit all of that into uh, this violence that you've talked about? Well, the assassination of Martin Luther King, he was shot and killed at the Lorraine Hotel while standing on his balcony, and right below him was Jesse Jackson, who was the first to notice that Martin Luther King perished. And he was murdered because he stood up for African American rights. He fought back against um, John Crow laws, Segregation. Jim Crow. Segregation. Segregation. And people didn't like that. So they decided to shoot him so it would all basically stop. Well, it hasn't. Then came the NAACP and they became stronger. And then they took over their, uh, that place. And, uh, the NAACP represents uh, Dr. King and his peaceful way of getting things over with, having rights for African Americans. Now, the Black Panthers. They were fought with violence, and uh, another thing that I think many people may know is that Tupac Shakur and his uh, mother and grandmother were all a part of the Black Panther Society, and they fought again. They fought for rights with anger. They did not fight in peaceful ways. The NAACP and Martin Luther King did. Now, the Black Panther Society represents Martin Luther King, and that's how that went along. And so you've got all of this violence, and, and, and in the end, over the last minute that we have here, uh, what would you say to young people in terms of all the things that you've said today about violence? How would you... Uh, I would say stop gun violence. Uh, I mean, it's, uh, who is it helping? Mm -hmm. You killing somebody else isn't helping anybody. You're just creating more violence for the world. Mm -hmm. And what, what would you say about all about, about the need for guns? Do you think that there's a real need for guns uh, anywhere now? Um, well, I'm not sure. Guns hurt people. Well, actually, I don't think there is a need for guns, really. I mean, now people say there is a need for guns, but what about protection. Now you'd have to live in a perfect world and have to uh, have no guns, no no anything, no crime, but there's always going to be guns around and no matter how, how much people try to stop it, it's up to, the, to, to today's generation to stop it. And so you think that there's a real need and, and, uh, on the part of people today to sort of come together and move against violence and uh, in a real sense, as Dr. Martin Luther King said, to love one another. You think that there's a need for that today and you stand uh, as an advocate for that kind of understanding. Is that, is that what you're telling me uh, as we enter uh, the last uh, 30 minutes, 30 uh, seconds of this show this day? I do. You believe that, uh, mm -hmm. and that, that people should be uh, uh, warm and, and, and wonderful toward one another and move away from violence, gun violence. Uh, hug each other, uh, hug your neighbor, love your neighbor. Love everybody. And, and, what's, and, what's the problem with that? And, okay, very good. Of course, Lana, let me thank you again for bringing by that unusual kind of information <laughs> uh, today. And uh, also, let me encourage our audience to uh, tune in again next week for another informative edition of Comments. Thank, thank you, you and, and good, good morning. morning.